Namaste my dear friends. In this video, we cover the area and perimeter of a rhombus. Before entering the topic, the basic properties we use here are, sides, angles, and diagonals of a rhombus. And, to prove the area of rhombus we use the area of triangle. According to the figure A, B, C, D is a rhombus. Here, all sides are equal. That is, the line segment AB, BC, CD, and DA are equal. This property helps to prove the perimeter of the rhombus. Opposite angles are equal. That is the angle A is equal to angle C and angle B is equal to angle D. Diagonals are dissimilar, that is the line segment A, C is not equal to the line segment B, D. But, the diagonals are perpendicular and bisect each other, that is, the line segment A, E, is equal to the line segment E, C, and the line segment B, E, is equal to the line segment E, D. To prove the area of rhombus, we use either four right angle triangles, or two acute angle triangles. Note, the area of triangle is the product of half, base, and height. To prove the area of rhombus we choose diagonals, here the diagonals in the figure are D1 and D2. Split the rhombus into two acute angle triangles. If we observe the triangles, one of the diagonal, D1 is sharing the common base in the two triangles, and the other diagonal D2 is shared equally, that is half D2 each. Here the two triangles are congruent to each other. So the area of the two triangles remains the same. We substitute the value of base and height in the formula, that is B and H. If we simplify the statement, we get the product of the quarter and the product of D1 and D2. This is the area of one triangle. As early, we discussed the two triangles are congruent. So the area of rhombus is equal to the sum of the two triangles. That is the sum of quarter D1 D2 and quarter D1 D2 is equal to half D1 D2. So, the area of rhombus is the product of half and the product of the two diagonals. According to figure A, B, C, D is a rhombus. Earlier, we have discussed that all sides are equal in rhombus. Let us take each side is A, here, A, is a variable. As we know perimeter means, the sum of all sides. That is, the line segment AB, plus BC, plus CD, plus DA. It can be written as, A, plus, A, plus, A, plus, A. Here, A, is repeated four times. So we can write it as four times A. Area of rhombus is the product of half D1, D2. If each side of a rhombus is A, then the perimeter of the rhombus is 4 times A. If you want more information about the content or anything related to the subject, please refer to the blogger and clarify your doubts. Thank you for watching the video friends.